this is this has been a, a weird time for me. Um, a lot of people probably don't know. I work part time for the Penguins since two thousand nine. Uh, the Pittsburgh Penguins, the hockey team in Pittsburgh, and uh, I've been a member of the organization for you know it's been oh my gosh almost eleven years, eleven almost twelve years now. And uh, they did something super special for me last week that was completely unexpected. Uh, they did totally surprise me. They asked me, the Pittsburgh Penguins Foundation asked me, can you come on in? And uh, we want to do a, a thing with you ringing the bell because they're, this month is Hockey Fights Cancer Month. So I just lucked out that um, I had cancer. <laughs> yes. Lucked out. Yeah. I know. Lucked out. It worked out perfectly for everyone. But uh, it was Hockey Fights Cancer Month. They do purple. And usually there's a big, you know, there's a game. We do a whole bunch of fun stuff and raise money and all that good stuff. But this, you know, with the pandemic, not so lucky to be in, in person or hockey even happening right now. But they still wanted to do something for Hockey Fights Cancer Month. Uh, the a week and, about a week and a half ago, I, they did an, an article. I was on the website. We talked about that. And then on Friday of this past week, they invited me down. They said, "Hey, we want to do something in the locker room. Uh, we're gonna have a bell for you to ring." And we're, you know, and I didn't think much of. I was like, "Oh, that sounds like." cool thing and they said you know bring whoever you'd like and I brought my mom with me and they invited my oncologist Dr. Puhala down too and so they we, you know we were waiting for everybody we, we walked in down to the locker room and I was like okay what you know I was getting ready I walked in and it was like the Penn's TV camera crew was there and I just mm -hmm. happened to look around and hanging in one of the the bays of the lockers was a jersey with my last name on it I if you watch the video, I turn around and walk out the door because I was just in such disbelief. And like I said, I had no idea what to expect. They honored me with a jersey. It's a, it's a, I have it here. It's beautiful. It's a nice, it's a heavyweight jersey. It's got my last name on it. It's the Hockey Fights Cancer. It's, I just love it. And um, they gave me a jersey. They had, interviewed me, had me ring the bell, um, which the, I didn't realize this, but the bell that if you've ever been to a game where you've seen someone ring a bell during the game, it was actually one of the members of the, one of the employees for the arena had built that specific bell to honor his brother, Dennis. And it's really sweet. And there's a nice plaque on the front. And I had no idea that, you know, this was like, because I've seen them ring the bell at games, but I didn't know much about it. But yeah, it's actually, they built it in honor of his brother. And, um, but yeah, so they interviewed me, recorded a thing. I cried. Uh, they had some of the folks from the 50-50 raffle, my coworkers, do a video. It was fun. And at the end, they dropped Sidney Crosby saying, hey, Katie, <laughs> and said some nice things. Like, we, yeah, I heard you're a pretty pos you know, positive person. And I, anything you see, the Pens Penguins made a gif of me, my reaction to getting a Crosby video. Everything was like, I had no idea, absolutely no clue. And, uh, but it was really cool. Uh, the video, they had it up on their Facebook page at all of their social media. Uh, the NHL actually shared it on their Facebook page and they have like 4 million likes on their page. And it was, it was wild. And I've gotten a lot of people, you know, reaching out and strangers. I mean, I, I, I've been checking the comments cause I'm, I'm, that's how I am. I'm nebby about that kind of stuff. And so many nice comments, so many people just saying nice things about my, you know, what I my journey and, and just everything in the, in the video and how many people, you know, touched and they cried and it was great. And it just, it, I think it was, it was a much needed, just positive thing put out into the world. And I think a lot of people appreciated that. And that definitely makes it so much cooler. <laughs> this thing has been consistently in my feed on social media. Every time I pull over and check in, I, I, I see this video over and over again. Or even like, hey, you're on KDKA now. Hey, you're on yeah. this now. You know, because of course, it, you know, they, they'll, they'll, they'll just pick those up and it just goes everywhere. Um, but that, that's, that's been awesome to see. Totally. Like I said, unexpected. It was, it was so nice. And, and I think I mentioned this in the video too. My mom, because of the virus, hasn't been able to be there for either, you know, when I finished chemo and I finished radiation, you ring the bell. My mom wasn't able to be there for either of them because of the virus. And for her to be there, and my mom's a breast cancer survivor. She rang the bell last year because she just went through this, a similar battle. And for her to be there to see that and just was just, it, it, it meant the world to me. Absolutely meant the world to me.